Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you for stopping by. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to remap the pop-up triggers on the Redmi K50 Gaming smartphone. This way, you can play whatever game you want as long as those configurations are there, you can remap them to the pop-up triggers. So, without further ado, let's jump into it. <laughs> You want to start by launching a game that makes use of the on-screen button configurations. In this example, we're going to be using Street Fighter V Champion Edition. Once you enter the game, you want to pause it, and if available, select button configurations. If not, you'll have to pause the game with the on-screen button configurations already showing. In the top left corner of the phone screen, there's a tab you can swipe right to open. Scroll down to pop up triggers and click on it. From here, you get the option to edit the left and right trigger buttons. Click on either trigger option and the process will be the same to remap both of the buttons. Drag either the left or right trigger icon to the desired action button or D-pad direction for your on-screen configurations. Then use save in the upper right corner of your screen. After saving and clicking done, if needed, your pop-up triggers are now remapped. This works on any game that has on-screen buttons, so it should work besides just a Street Fighter game. Any other game you want where you can use the controls on the actual screen for your game, this should work for. If this video was helpful, please drop a like and subscribe to the channel. I greatly appreciate it, and the channel does too. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace. <laughs>